Imagine waking up one morning with what seems like a simple cold only to find yourself or a loved one struggling to breathe within days. A virus is silently spreading across the globe and it's one you might not even know, human metanema virus or HMPV. In 2025, this often overlooked virus has emerged as a growing public health concern, making headlines for its alarming impact. What makes it so dangerous and why should you care? Welcome back to Medical Minds. Stay with me as we uncover everything you need to know about the HMPV outbreak, its symptoms, risks, and most importantly, how can you protect yourself and your loved ones? This information could save your lives. HMPV or human metanema virus is a respiratory virus first identified in 2001 belonging to Paramyxoviridae family. It is closely related to virus like the respiratory syncytial virus and the parainfluenza virus. It primarily affects the upper and lower respiratory tract, causing illness that can range from mild cold-like symptoms to severe respiratory distress. This year, HMPV has caused a surge in hospital admissions worldwide. According to recent epidemiological reports, the virus has shown an unusually high transmission rate, likely due to post-pandemic immunity gaps and increased global travel. In regions with colder climates, hospitals are reporting ICU bed shortages due to an influx of patients with severe HMPV infections. HMPV spreads through respiratory droplets, much like influenza or COVID-19. These droplets are expelled when an infected person coughs, sneezes, or even talks. You can also contract the virus by touching contaminated surfaces and then touching your face, particularly your eyes, nose, or mouth. Once inside the body, the virus targets the epithelial cells lining the respiratory tract, leading to inflammation and the symptoms we will discuss next. Symptoms of HMPV can vary in severity depending on the individual's age, immune status, and overall health. Here is what to watch out for. In mild cases, runny nose, cough, sore throat, low-grade fever. In moderate to severe cases, shortness of breath, wheezing, high fever, fatigue, chest pain due to inflammation. In severe cases, bronchiolitis, pneumonia, exacerbation of asthma or COPD hypoxemia, which is low blood oxygen levels, which may require hospitalization. HMPV does not discriminate, but certain groups are more susceptible, including children under the age of 5 because their immune systems are still developing. Elderly individuals, aging of the immune system makes them vulnerable. Immunocompromised patients, including those undergoing chemotherapy, organ transplant recipients, and people with HIV or AIDS. Individuals with chronic respiratory conditions such as asthma, COPD, or interstitial lung disease. Healthcare workers are also at risk due to their close contact with infected patients. Prevention is always better than cure. Here is how you can reduce your risk of contracting HMPV. Wash your hands frequently with soap and water for at least 20 seconds or use an alcohol-based hand sanitizer. Avoid close contact. Maintain distance from individuals exhibiting respiratory symptoms. Regularly disinfect high-touch surfaces such as doorknobs, light switches, and electronic devices. Wear a well-fitted mask in crowded or healthcare settings, especially during outbreaks. If you or someone in your household develops symptoms, isolate promptly to prevent spreading the virus. HMPV may be silent but serious respiratory threat, especially in vulnerable populations, by staying informed, practicing good hygiene, and seeking medical care when needed. You can significantly reduce your risk to protect those around you. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends and family and subscribe to Medical Minds for more expert insights into the latest health topics. Until next time, stay safe, stay informed and take care of your health. Thank you.